Hey guys, welcome back. In our last video, we have seen the authorization code flow. The another majorly used code flow, the uh, author to flow, is the client credentials flow. Right. So this is a simple, uh, uh, you know, way how we can get an access token and access the resource. So this is widely used uh, between uh, microservices. So you have a microservice architecture where you want uh, only the um, authorized uh, microservice to access the resource right so in that case you will be going for the client credentials flow where all the microservices will be registering to the uh, authorization server as a client and further they will be requesting access token to get the resource uh, you know get the protected resource access right so this is basically a machine to machine communication right at that time we'll be using this so this how this simply works is you'll be adding the client id and the secret uh, the client application will be adding the client id and the secret to the authorization server uh, as a first request and further the authorization server will you know respond back to you with the access token and this access token will be uh, serving the purpose of getting the protected resource from the resource server so this is so simple so let's explore the code i have what i have done is i have created one more client uh, which is named as a client credential so this client is registered as um, a client uh, to allow uh, client credential flow right so you see if you look at here uh, the grant type is client client credential so this client will be uh, given access token by using the client credentials itself right so this can be easily tested by using the postman so you can go to postman so let me go here and show you here uh, if you look at here i have just mentioned this client a credential so i have mentioned the client credential what i have given and uh, the scope uh, that's not required ideally um, so that just mentioned the scope and uh, this i've already explained i've just mentioned uh, mentioned as a client credentials in the body and let me uh, try to get the access token now so it hit my uh, authenticate method where it will verify um, the client credential so there is a separate filter the provider for OAuth to client credential authentication provider so this provider will get called whenever there is a client credential uh, grant type is mentioned in your client right so this is gonna give you the access token so if you look at here the authentication is complete and go to proceed and if you look at here we have an access token and with this access token let me use this access token and um, let's put the access token here and hit the resource server this is 8085 is our resource server let me hit this and see the result so we got hello world so that's how the client credential flow works so this is a very simple flow and similarly we have implicit and password so those are not uh, widely used so if you guys need a video on that please mention in the comments so that i can um, you know do one for those and um, thank you for watching the video if you feel this video is useful for you please don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll see you in the next one bye bye